Madonna, Michael Jackson, The Birdcage, Evita, Hook, and Cirque du Soleil. Vincent Patterson, a man with a rich career in choreography, dance, and directing that's seen him create some truly groundbreaking moments without which who knows where we'd be today. Growing up doing social dancing, Vincent didn't start his formal training until the age of 24, and once in LA studied with the legends Joe Tremaine and Bill and Jackie Landrum. Vince landed his first job with the prolific choreographer and teacher Joe Bennett for a Dick Van Dyke TV special. This led to a string of tours, commercials, and television specials. During a break from touring, Vincent had time to work with the famed choreographer Michael Peters and participate in his famed choreography workshops. This intensely creative and physically challenging choreography workshop led Vincent to audition for Peters and Michael Jackson and book the gig dancing in Jackson's music video, Beat It. Following the success of that music video came the stratospheric catapult for Jackson, the Thriller music video. Vincent was hired as the assistant choreographer to Michael Peters and danced as one of the famous featured zombies. Thriller became a global force that still pulses today. Cut to five years post-Thriller, Vincent received a fateful call from Michael Jackson about a new song he wanted to create a short film for, Smooth Criminal. Vincent was hired to conceptualize, creative direct, and choreograph the video. After Smooth, Vincent worked on a rapid-fire string of immensely successful projects, including Madonna's acclaimed yet controversial long-form commercial for Pepsi with her song, Like a Prayer. Next came choreographing Express Yourself, directed by David Fincher. It was a song about female empowerment and only accepting the best for yourself at a time when that was not a popular message to give. Vincent's idea to have Madonna grab her crotch in the video elicited gasps the world over. The move became a recurring theme in Madonna's performances. After Madonna enlisted a modern choreographer from New York to do her new tour, she ultimately brought Vincent back in. He had one condition. He wanted to direct and choreograph the show. The Blonde Division Tour cemented Madonna's fame in the stratosphere of female singers and made her the most famous female singer of her time. In the middle of mounting the tour, they were also creating and filming the groundbreaking music video Vogue bringing voguing out of the clubs and into mainstream pop culture. After the cone bras and gender bending of the Blonde Ambition Tour, Vincent was given the opportunity to create the Vogue number anew for a third time. He came up with the idea for Madonna playing Marie Antoinette with her 18th century courtly men, and from there, another pop culture juggernaut. The number for Madonna at the Academy Awards for the film Dick Tracy. After almost four decades in the entertainment industry, Vincent is still going strong. We don't have nearly enough time to list all his successes, but here are just a few more that you might have seen. The Bad Tour, Black or White, The Way You Make Me Feel, to other music videos and live performances with Michael Jackson, such as the Grammy Awards and a little show called the Super Bowl Halftime. Vincent also choreographed the wildly successful film The Birdcage with Robin Williams, Evita with Madonna, Hook for Steven Spielberg, and directed and choreographed the musical sequences in Lars von Trier's Dancer in the Dark with Bjork. Vincent wrote, directed, and co-choreographed Cirque du Soleil's Viva Elvis, and he still shows no signs of stopping. 